Alaji Hussainu Numukunda Dabo, Secretary General, Party Leader, United Democratic Party. Sotola, uh, Muslim Carola. Madam Jones. Nasangurdika Legi oh, Sorry, let me take it in English. Sorry. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Thank you. May I now thank you, thank you, ma'am, for, for your prayers, and may all our prayers be answered. Uh, may I now have the honor to invite the Emir of the Ahmadiyya Jamaat community to lead us in uh, Muslim prayers. Amir. Alhamdulillah, <laughs> Allahumma salli ala Muhammadin wa ala al Muhammad kama salata ala Ibrahim wa ala al Ibrahim innaka Hamidul Majid Allahumma barik ala Muhammadin wa ala al Muhammad kama barikta ala Ibrahim wa ala al Ibrahim innaka Hamidul Majid Arabana atina fi dunya hasanatan wa fil akhirati hasanatan kana jaban nar may Allah almighty bless this forum for the benefit of the Gambian people and for their interests May God bless all of you. Amen. Assalamu alaikum. Amen, Ya Rabbi. Alama Dual Jabila, Yana Yala Nangunyan. Ladies and gentlemen, the Secretary General just told me that we have lost so much time. Uh, our proceedings should have concluded by now for the opening ceremony. So Mbalbe Danila Almo Kendol Minu Bebejang Nga Kata Nga Congress Oke Bunyani Horomo Kono Paski Congress Sanjifula O Sanjifula Lenka Ke Ntolbe Alaji Usen Dabo Nala Nomonyol Anala Molbe Ibentul 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 Iye bori balile ini urala oi joni masale kele diara usenula dabojila dabole dabole useni dabole emo mamarinde dabole dobo dabole Kele diara usenula Bori Bali Kiri Bali Sankajang Bori Bali Jalur Alimbara, Alimbara. Nyimfanan dah be Kongres tu le, pasti na adu le mungkin tu, na cusan le. Fon namo, namo kendolu. Ni ni la dia muatu sita, minyak long. Ye la cusan ofo, ye la kunung fo. Pasti wakar jiko kafule. Lita mici Kongres bila bokanda. Nir kubah soko ame bah narek nyuwah bahayam dah lul defa dalal hel defa tak juga na amyakar. Therefore, on behalf of the entire executive, on behalf of the membership of the United Democratic Party, on behalf of the diaspora chapters of the United Democratic Party, it gives me great pleasure. It gives me a great honor to welcome
the next president of the Republic of the Gambia, Alaji Usenu Numukunda Dabo. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Moderator. Democracy la kanyanda. Democracy kanyanda kanyanda. Allah barakala bini nyalale. Et Alpha, 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 So, Mbalbe Kontona. Nami Rambeka Skelale. Natra, Mosabal Bijanto, Mankonton de Bunyarin de Walla. Olom Ambassador Olti, Ibrahim Amane, Mamad Lam Sidat Job, Ani Ramza Diab. Nilkata Mollet Mela Lon Kavoko, Etata Gambia Bantala, Yedoko Gambia, Pur Gambia Lanafakan. Barbi, Emantra Palazoto. Adu Bajanto B so Nyantale ke konton kate do komen ki jedo ya ke gambiale adu baltan la nyina ko baltan la nyina ka kawo ko almam malundi ndeme nga recommendation ke kawo ko ale ale ke ambassador ti ale do ko ka nyam almam almam malundi ala baraka bage so fo nga recognize eh ni mukulat me yalon kawo ko sanwo san sanju flow sanju flan nyantal ka ke gambia lu wal dam mam ma fo ko nyake But in falling a law, I mean, in falling, the constitution, na kijele, kavuko sanju flo, sanju fula, fancy sealle, na pati wala kuol kacha, ngamfan jube, ngamfan crossi, na hello beda me, na ya kavuko ngolto podo, anin na nyata tala nyame nyato, wosilon ngi, wosilon ngi wala, wale adnam bijanto bi, na dasbaran kuol bijanto, mela lon kavuko wal final mulo la ballet pati oni, imnanga mo men nata bijanto. Pour nous congrès là, à ce moment-là, nous avons un peu de temps. Mr. Président de la Diaspora, nous avons un peu de temps. L'UDP, nous avons un peu de temps. 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 Nous avons un Pati balti, dole melko imu pati balti be yaila, nuwa la kongresita, mwale tabola nantubabu du, hani sana gali mwale tabola nanyakana jeto, na atla itel mampazo kia. Bari, yung kongres ni akumaya tabake, kanyino pati wala kongres labanti jani eleksono, ni eleksono membina la teng, Walau be Gambia Bondila, walau be Gambia Pinendila. Ni election ni membina lete, walau ba kende Gambia Nkolo. Ila kamfroya me ya long kavu ko ya kuma 2016 iba 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 kumfano la. 2016 Gambia dingu funti ta. Ija ma jama ilota tilol koto. Purkata kato fai. Mola Mohamed Imam Mola Silandri me bodi jeto Mola Bure me bodi jeto ilafta menke la purike fang kanandi ya kato fali ya fang kanandi ya kadali lol melkama ndesan Gambia B wadali lol inyata wala ne dali la kotendo yo moli wala moli ya chika wala kwebe Gambia muna kela kwebe performs nyo lkala ka falin roll ke kwebe falin roll kela tamar nyato bar kunu melka ya jame tumi Ikafu kwa yajamani nyimkamangkore, 
Il y a des policiers, il y a des services de sécurité. Même si quelqu'un est en train de se faire, il y a des services de sécurité. 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 Wato dem bang bang kala janto bi mantra pati wada mana kuwa kachala barigam bara sama mbole kachala atal mel bata nang dula alto taring kabo kabiri kantora kana fo kombo south kabo kabiri lower nyomi kata fo wuli east tal mel nata janto nyong congress to albesi la janda kabangko la kuwa kachala na bangko ni nyanta samba la nyame. Na responsibility lomo kaja ko nyimbango akana tuding kadi fito na jolo taka kolong kono dingo kono tongo kolong boka bundi na sakura koko kuteng wata linka na song linka na song nyim nyim fito mmo Gambia di ai jolo dingo kono Gambia ilu inyanta mengine yoleke yamanza kunda tumbong. Je ne sais pas si c'est ce qu'il y a. Mais je ne sais pas si c'est ce qu'il y a. Je ne sais pas si c'est ce qu'il y a. Millions de Kemewaro, millions de gens qui ont été dans l'office de la dépense. Ou bien qu'il y a. Je ne sais pas si c'est ce qu'il y a. Je ne sais pas si c'est ce qu'il y a. Même dans l'agriculture, il y a des millions de gens qui ont été dans l'agriculture. Amulita million adobat million mua nyombete itani waltema. Ela boka munda ge la doko magefemvedi focal si state house mualbe yuko mualbe bola na kombo south ikana kavu yuko mbeku. Mualbe sirfo mualbe bola na leko kumbeku. Meli alon kavu kwa wale nyanta nyimbango da kwa la. Meli alon kavu kwa nyimbango la fanga wale nyanta yiruandi la. Wa imani fendi wala. Bari ubeba manja wanya. Ubeba manja wanya. Yana na. Million, yana na yana na dalsu wad dalsu buli keme, dalsu buli tal lulu, yota yodi fana koko ila depanso lulu lulu, yana tama ramu demor si fale kake nyublado, dalsu buli keme, dalsu buli tal lulu, dalsu buli keme, dalsu buli tal lulu, koko elun kilin depanso di. Ndé bingi ma besi ndé bangu nda amansi amanda somo ke yalimbai kuto mama muso wabe badibu wamen kontro soto rohima likuwa badil be salum imansi imang soto mo killing wuli kama wuli tanlu kadi wala wala mnyi bangu la nafati ba ni lamu kudima ya long kavoko ni anda ngali kolo ka kaboni ni bangu kanga. Ni elekshono mimi na nak walomkuti mayalangavuko asinsamano kala kilo bulandi kula ninga fo njiso aka naso ndomo ka aka kaka sunu baake dua keta bara ninga kote na kadua ke mkoto ama mteri ma mkulo nyo mkuke nyo lamin dambi ndiba. Je suis venu à la Congrès. Le Congrès est venu à la Congrès. Il 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 est venu à la Congrès. Alla sija jangsona ve ayemen tumbulu ngana na fawala ayemen tumbulu ngana na fawala ngaje kafoko alo hammo ani melta mani mel ya kafoko wala sa trankeata atenya ibe kula kele ka nyon nyato ngadol tofo kunda kamara sa jo kunda sa ni nyolu ini hammo le fata oro hammo al ngaje ko ngolti mandi 
ባል በኮንዶና ስፔሻሊ ና ዳስፖራ ሞሉ በ ኮንዶ ድሮ ፈናንከላ አላጂ ኮንቴ ዶማ ዴርማ አንድ ኦፍ ኮስ ወል መልበ ሳንቶ ጃዳ ናል ፈናል ኮንዶ ካዱ አተለሙ ካዱ አተለሙ ና እ ጎድ መላ ለን ካው ኮና ቢን ወቤን አተለሙ ና ቢን ለኮቲ ዲን ኮ ማንትራኪ ዶ ታቡ ካዲያ አተለሙ ና ኮቲ ዳንክ ዩ ቬሪ ሞች ካናብ 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 ባር ሙሶዶ ልኮንቶ አላ በረከ አላ በረከ አላ በረከ አላ በረከ አላ በረከ አላ በረከ አ አብ አብ ካታሪ አከለባሪ ቦኬ ቦኬ ለቢ ከነባሪ ሙሶዶ ልኮንቶ አኒም ቢንክ ኞሉ ጁግና ጁግና ኬባ ቢንክ ሎማቲ ባዳ ማሳሆ ወልሙ ባዲ ሙሶለቲ ነ ወለ ወሉታ ቡንክሊን ኮኖ ካናጃንቱ ቢ ከ አልማም ወልና አልፋሊ መንከ ምፋን ምም ወለ ካከጃንቱ ቢ አየን ኮንታን ፈንቲ ጃቶን ሳል 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 ጆን መና አላ በረካ በሞ ቢ ኮንታና ወሰላም derejev derejev dabo jula bonane amna protocol bo amul de ah sorry sorry ah mane melen sorry 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 protocol bo infa de de sorry balal as ala baraka ala baraka eh ya ala baraka ala baraka አ አይ ጂሚ ጂሚ ጂሚና በከኝናልዴ ጋ ጂሚ ጂሚና በከኝናለ ባሪ ኘ ሙኝ ነው መንቲ አሲሪዮሳ ባከለ እ አ ይነ ማክራይም ላ አጂያም ወመ ፈለ ሙኔ ክራይም ላ ጋም ኛር ጃባር ጀልን ባንጁል ጋዋ በፈረ ወሁሎ ቺ ኦሎፍ ወኔ ሎል ዳል ናታስ መጀባሪ ሜተ ቡግ ማኞኝ ሜሬማ ተ አ ማተንሃ ለማዶንዋ ቺ አይ ካዱ ጋታ አ ጀልበን ቢዲኒ ኘብ ቺ ፊነካ ቺ ቺ ራኘ ስማ ፓፓ ስማ ኦንኮል Alaj MC Cham uh, Alaj Yaya Sisi ak suma colleagues giti ak representative political parties vineka uh, jisna ci jotay bi suma magitam Alaj Dr Sisi mo vita di konyu and uh, sun ambassador si nyati ambassador si Mr Job Mr Mane Ms Diab dire niu and uh, again patela why ni ko hamne tam ma ko ko ligue bokal ligue ci anam bu nek euh ci ligue loya ok boka euh Mrs Ben Souda ame Ben Souda sumarakala suma sista la mo sumaraka Mariama Dabo ño nak xarit an ci ko lol mutiyam asmagam ci profession bi tam mo mo ma sama cheur ti masma so mang len di new di new alaji conte di new kep ak wa democracy len new congress bi nak bu ño def ni defan nak 
daje bo xamne loi mo ñu ko santa né ñaar at bu nekk parti bu nekk da nga war am sa congress waye fekk bala lolu ñun united democratic party dañ ko def ci chin constitution bi né ñaar at bu nekk de ño def congress pour gestu dohalin pati bi gestu do xew xew bi ci ci rew mi ñu mëna ci jël ay decision ci ay da ci dohalin pati bi o ci is ci events nga xamne ñu ngay jël place ci code ci ci rew mi lolo war ñu oté ndajé bi kontan nañ né euh ni ko fogé non lay démé euh congress bi nak dina ci wax dal lu bari wa li ci am solo moy 2021 2021 dañ wara fexé rétal gambia parce que len gis moy 2016 gambia ci dañ geena ñu taxaw ci ci ronna gambia ci dañ campagne gu dé bëcce fu nak lañ dem ñu ngi tédda ay place so xamné place so xamné ra it was difficult for them di ñoo lekka li ñoo li ñu bëgga way ci ko lool yépp ñu ñu déterminé li fi nekk dina ko géné géné nañ ko té biñ ko doon géné nak ci kaw dalil lañ né ci sapé ngour bi nak dafa wara am wéccé wéc ko yo xamné daf ko wara def ay reforms yo xamné def day lén day gour gi daf ko wara def wa lan lañ gis moy ñi nga xamné on sa mi fak ki nga xamné mo jité réew mi lépp lim waxon ci yaaya jamé né yaaya jamé da fay def lu bon lépp lim ci def mom lu mo def mo opa bu yaaya jamé so man mom man bossam man bossé dama gis né xeyna mom bo na yaaya jamé bu doon wax daf ko doon def pour bopam wa nekku né jëriñ réew mi la jëssu né yaaya jamé lim doon def daf doon lor réew mi wa daf doon gis né li o joxna ma opportunity pour man tam ma dem di campaign di soufelo yaaya jamé so li ñoo li ñoo am lim fi am tay mo gën mo fa mo gën mo bon dañ li nekkon ci ya ci ci jamano ya jamé parce que ya jamé yeen mi fi tok di majority of yi fa ñi ñi nga xamné ñoo votal president adama boro votal ñu ko pour né mu ñew délosi fi lu fi lu ya jamé lu fi doon def lolo ta lo tawut ngeen ngeen wot ngeen wotel ko waye ay na daf gis né lolu mo gën ci mom wax waxet mo gën ci mom té day wara gis né ngour gogo ñu gënné ko naka la ñoo mëné tok ñu gis government bi di jël 627 million dollars de ko allocate office of the president adama baro muy jël muy ko fe ñu ko muy jël fe ñu ko fe 250000 dollars per year delu wadi di jël 150000 dollars dépenses pour benabis xama ban façon lek la ñoo lek fofu xama ban façon bir lañ am pour fa la pour pour lek lolu liay yi nak yi ñoo ñoo ta ñu wara gis né next elections ñu vote in the government bo xamné da fay topato mbiri gambians yi government bo xamné da fi am yermande pour gambians yi parce que man mun ma xam 150000 dollars is lolu open a salary of some a lot of the permanent maybe some of the permanent secretaries or some of the directors benn nit di dépenser lolu ya man bo jangé né bajanam falé ci badibu o ci ñoomi ena ko ka nge xalat lu mo lek gebel yi ñu nge na di ñoo dañoo wojan parce dañ bu am dañ bu am lu ñoo lek way ñoo dañoo dem mo muy jox bopam 150000 dollars li nak mo mo ñoo li nak mo mo ñoo mo ñoo woné mo li wo gambians ni ñun ak arma baro duñ bena te bi muna nek bena lota di muna nek bena parce que ñun 22 years ci luñ doon wax ci luñ nek ci loy lañ nak bente ñi nga xamne day ñew yaaguñ fa they are not imbued with the principles and ideas of udp ñom ñoy behave in that way way nak lo nak dina daga 
niko aje ya mondo ya bo wae 2021 ni johe ya jame bye bye 2016 ni johe ya jame bye bye 2021 itam non la ño johe arma baro bye bye Eh yeah. sinko def sinko joxe bye bye it will be decisive one bo xamne ben werante di ci am soy degane nay recount da nga am wot 53% and above the udp target udp target moy minimum 53% lol kenn ko meuna wedi way nak ci ci congress bi nak il a une role out in policies pour wa gambian ci ak sun delegué ci lan lañ amal gambian ci suñu joxé ngour gi té lepp li ñoo ici du leen wax duñ duñ délu wat wax leen né dédé xam nga so ci sama wax leen lolu dama doon campagne dama leen wax lolu so ñu ngi leen di gërem da di leen santa di sante way di ñaan yalla ne euh waxtan bi ñoo waxtan among suñu delegation ñu ni neen na nek am waxtan bo xamne da nay nak ci njeriñu rew mi mu nek jeriñi suñu doomi wa salam am jerejef jerejef parti leader Um, Fogumane Jarna Sahma Delu Chili Pati Lida Wa Wa e bahna rek uh, Pour nyu degeral Bena nyari kadu Dakte a jumala uh, Nyungi wara dem uh, Juli juma Nyungi wara anyi e, Chi wahta anam uh, Mom Pati Lida Wahna ne Gambia pour mu dem kanam dañ soxla rek njit ño xamne dañ mandu a dañu deggu duñ jël alali mbolo diko tassare diko pisir passar dépasse bi nek ci office president bi ak ci ni mo doxale andan do rami neku ñet neku ñi def dara ci rew mi ganaaw rambaj ganaaw tas ya kari nit ñi bu gëna ñoo bolo tas gambia def ko ay xarit xarit yo xamne du njëriñ kenn pati li rabi tamit ñaan bolo mi fi pour ñu gëna takku gëna liggey yobu suñ rew ci kanam lim wax leerna lim wax amna mana te jaliba kuyati woyon nako fi sax mu ne su ko nehon mu ne ka waliw su ko nekon su ko nehon mu ne ka bur ñun mi liggey ak mom ak ñom mi sis ami ben suda ñenen fukki atak lu topa neka na top lo ya gambia fi lolu rek doyna ndam doyna titero so ñu ko ñaanal di ñaanal wa udp di ñaanal rewmi euh pour yalla yagal len fi suñ kanam yoka sen lèr euh acting national president nak waxna mune mom li bëggona wax sax waxu ko ndax gambia yeb ño fi tok dafa bëggon rek bala ño def ci last activity ci opening ceremony bi euh ñu ñaanal parti bi ñu ñaanal suñ rew euh du ben yoon du ñaari yoon a uh, pour liño mebet li liño djublu ci ni yalla meñu ci ndam so on behalf of uh, national acting president mangé ñaan bolo mi yeb su féké né mën nañu ñaan uh, ñun kéna kéna pour uh, yalla meñu ndam uh, ci uh, election bi ñoo djublu ci ni a uh, bismillah salatu ala nabi bismillah rahman rahim allahumma salli Allahumma salli wa salli ala sayidina wa nabiyyina
Je ne sais pas si vous avez un événement, Mr. Barhama et Groubambi, qui a activité dans le programme de Fogna Kasamas Boyo. Mr. Barhama, vous avez le floor, sir. Yeah. Uh, greetings to each and every one of you. My name is Barhama Chan, and together uh, with my uncle, Uncle Koli, most of the time before, before performing, I always want to have some time with the people, you know, because, you know, music is nice. Sometimes I will just want to remind people back to the beautiful songs from the Smiling Coast. Are you guys ready to, to sing along with me? Stop spreading, huh? Let me start it like this. Who knows this song? Kalei Africa, Nenlen Andando, Boka Bena Hol, Bokit Bena Ban, Tubabi Nakone, Sunyu Mam Yam, Kajalele, Fewalele, Beni de la France, Ni Angale. Ni Portuguese, ni Italia, okay? And then the world, the devil and the fair. You know, I want to sing with people. Are you guys here? Can I, can I take it to the culture? Who knows the song? Sona Maria, oh, Sona Maria. Aha, I get this one. Can we go with another one? Who knows the song? For the Nyinkili. <laughs> anyway, anyway, it's a pleasure for me to be here. This song is called Gambia Sumareo, dedicated to every Gambian, just to remind people the beautiful country that we have. So it's always good for us to preserve the peace, for us to be together as one people. So this is Gambia Sumareo, dedicated to every one of us. I'm a fee, who can't move, who love, who can't 
Entertainment <laughs> na luntam bu ñaari ngol mu ni bébé sirin jam ba folé al barka al jarama jérejé ndef euh ci sen téway euh fatena wa his excellency ambassador kemé sen jamé mu ci high table bi his excellency euh the deputy speaker of the national assembly alaji mot sané executive member mu ci high table bi euh her excellency nogoy ndjay and no going to be high table be executive committee member and the majority leader Keba Kebaro Mohamed Mungi won't be high table be Jerry and Jeff thank you very much this brings us to the end of the opening ceremony uh, we are all set for going to Juma uh, in the afternoon uh, my colleague uh, Mrs. Uh, Oli Dibawada uh, will be uh, holding the uh, proceedings uh, for our policy discussions. Thank you very much and have a, a Juma Mubarak. Uh, we'll see the rest of the delegates after Juma. Thank you very much. Thank you. this hall by 3 p.m. I repeat, Mbolomi Manglena Wanelen li opening ceremony bila won, sun gani maga yeb nyungini di dem, sun joge juma sun anye bepare warna nyo delua ti congress hall bi at 3 o'clock. Delegate soul mbafola liko opening ceremony drone neketa na bunyato lundangol be felebe sekang Juma kola anin kondon kola nyanta nga muruna kongres. Uh, talan saba watu le mbe nyanta muruna uh, kongres. Kongres fangoe binadati kula le. Nyimu opening ceremony le dunu. Ladies and gentlemen, this was the end of the opening ceremony. All our VVIPs are now taking their leave. After Juma and lunch, we are supposed to reconvene in Congress. I repeat, I hope this is absolutely clear now. Allah baraka al nimbara. Jere Jenjef, then you are at the at 3 o'clock. Delegates all, delegates all, bella condom me janne, bebe condom na nyoka ne jan. So, nimbora juma salo la drong, ngana condom me janne, condom kola, Congress be continue la. Delegates yep nyungle na wahnele na andi fila, nyunye pa anyandor. So sun juli juma be parerek, ni juli juma, nyudel si watfi, nyudef Congress be. Uh, second part B. And be feel a condom of a jane, you learn a yan rec, new jema de luga, dem juma, sunjoge juma, a new new delusi congress. B.
Assalamu alaikum alma me a tay a de ñew fi a pour ñu bëgg waxtana ak yem a tay ñi ñi lan lañu expect from UDP sen congrès bi a 2020 am nga congrès mom ñaari ab yu ñaari ñaari ab yu nek dañ fo nga am ko waye dafa dafa de bessal dafa bessal place yi dafa bessal gis gis parti bi dafa won tamit doomi parti bi naka la len parti bi fonké so li ñoo internal démocratie lolu la ñoo expect ci ñaari ñaar ñetti fan yi le ñu nek ni li am solo ci congrès moy digante congrès ak congrès yi xewon yeb naka la tedé dépasse bi yi ci duga naka la amé fan lañ ko duggal amna ci solo pour ñuy won rek doomi parti bi né ah yo duggalon nga trans duggalon nga dalasi ni la ko parti bi défé ci li lañ nek ci yi la ñoo yëngatu so congrès bi this year nek na congrès bo xamné ñun ñung ko titéro ndax musuta am congrès bu démé ni logistics yépp dañ ko jox professionnel ko xamné moko mo nek di ci dox ba nga xamné ñun mën nañu anda suñu sago mën nañu topato agenda congrès bi so congrès bo xamné la mu ngi dalal hel mu ngi woné tamit né UDP dimba nim melon légui ñaar fukki at ak ñenen mu ngi am mu ngi am mu ngi gëna am doole mu ngi also gëna am nim ñu baax ño xamné dañu ñoo bokk ci parti bi so su su lolu nopé ñu ngi wara am rally dimanche pour woné njiti ainsi ak place ainsi parti bi am pour naka lañu yobo gambia ndax ñu ngi jubal ci 2021 lolu la bëgg la té ah sen congrès bi bon gëriñ la dé amal gambian ci am lim dé amal gambian ci moy political party la political party bo xamné yalla may nako majority ci gambia ba pare li ñoo wax démocratie moy moy nguur go xamné da nga deglu mbolo su la yalla joxé mbolo dafa tax nga mëna doxal dikk bi ci loi ci doxalin bo xamné dal na xel doxalin bo xamné dina dimbalé ñi gëna ndool ñi amul doole ak ñi nga xamné amuñ seen loxo jotut seen ganaaw so internal democracy process bobu nak dafa baax rek pour mu 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 dampa xol yi soppi jikko yi ba nga xamné nit ñi du ñu nek di saganté wala di xulo di xé wala di gañanté ci affaire yi doxalini rew so lolo tax mu am njëriñ trop ci rew su fekkene nit ñi am nañ democratic mindset dafa tax dañu nango waxtaan ak mbolo dañu nango waxtaan ci seen biir be wax bi nga xamné mbolo mi mom lañ support wax bobu moy mëna taxaw ah loy wa gambian say ma ngi leena wax nak fu mu nek dañu wara baye xel bu baaxa baax ndax amna ño xamne ñu ngi wër ci dëkk bi di rambaj di jëm pour tass dëkk bi ñaar wala tass ko ci ay pat yu bari liggey mom rek moy yo ici teranga adina mom rek moy yo bu rew ci kanam nañu wañi wax ji wax yo xamne amul ben mana ñi nga xamne ñu ngi jël alali mbolo diko tassare diko pisir passare ñu baye sen xel lolu lek haram la te lolu wa as muslims war nañ ci baye xel bu baaxa baax alali mbolo du sa alal du sa alalu baye du sa alalu ndey du sa alalu mak alali mbolo mi la so soko amé yaakar motax ñu jox la ko baaxna rek ñun gambian si buñ nango nasa ñu baye ay ño xamne musu ño xam liggey buñ def gambia fi ñu amé alali mbolo diko diko pisir passare jere yef Assalamu alaikum mero ay todi madum aja ya mu ndaw yaabu aji ya mu ndaw yaabu ah bi nga jele ko am fele jam paradise jang ah UDP la congress to ah 2020 ah lafta pour aller afu mol le ko ah mol albe mu mol mol be mu ne expect come from UDP ah mol be ko ken do don le expect la ka fi te ñi ko reji ya jele dañu manke ta mo ta jana ka naati di amant Nah, mungkin lah fikir konstitusi konstitusi, wujudnya natal. 
na delegation be aliaji ibe nata ku ku planta ku atata ku atata nyama 2020 man sakunda le besiri 2021 man si follow ba man sakunda le besiri wala mu yudi bi la man sakunda ma yudi pi le besiri ha wala besiri ita aja yam do ya won tele nga wofo Aliyamu elembadi ngol aya aya yamundo aya yamundo wako a 2020 a UDP level siri alvele au mwenyola siri ibe muda pola gambi ansole gambi ansole ibe na hani minu bota no UDP tata yena yemi tuja wole bija nto manta hani jani jang bari mbesiri jang ibe na muri ila suo kono na banko samba aya tembe mo besi le nyanto soto katu for for how many years ngawole kile nu. Alla ni congress a alka kale every 2 two, two years but ni congress aka munna fale soto bankola aka na fa bale soto wala munti ka to nyan tole bi ji ni jamano do be duma mi ya lon ko ni titi je wala bake la wala tina a fem fem buka fel ji a beka correct all the time example sadia la dembo ba fo wala munna national president bari nga mi la sanyi saba mo ma je tele be active national president person of each area council or party sponsored candidate to form part of the membership of the regional executive committee under the chairperson of each regional committee the women win chairperson of each regional committee the coordinator of each regional committee also to form part of the membership of the of each regional committee that article 10 of subsection is also amended in subsection 4 by deleting the word 6 and replacing it with the word three at amendment of article 11 article 11 of the concern was amended in subsection one paragraph two by inserting before the word deputy and the word one as paragraph two and by inserting paragraph two as second and deputy national president Article 11 of the concern is amended in subsection 1, paragraph 18, by inserting below it new paragraph 18b, auditor, and 18c, deputy auditor. The same Article 11 of the concern is amended in subsection 5, by inserting after paragraph 31b, new paragraphs 32 auditor, and this define the function of the auditor. Amendment of Article 16. Article 16 of the Constitution is amended in subsection 1, paragraph 1, by inserting new paragraph after 26 as 27 weeks will read the party mayor or mayoress or area council chairperson or sponsored candidate. Article 16 of the Constitution amended in subsection 1, 3, after paragraph 26 by inserting a new paragraph as 27, the party mayor or mayoress or the chairperson of each area council or sponsored candidate and this defines the function of the said officers. As will 16 of the Constitution is amended in subsection 1, paragraph, paragraph 4, by deleting the word Secretary General, and by inserting a new paragraph after subsection 1, 1, 4, as Administrative Secretary. And this put in place the office of the Administrative Secretary in each regional office to be appointed. Article 6, 16 of the Constitution is amended in subsection 1, paragraph 1, 5, by deleting the words Deputy Secretary General, by inserting new clause after subsection 1, paragraph 1, 5, as 5, 2, Deputy Administrative Secretary. Article 16 of the Constitution amended in subsection 1, paragraph 3, 4, by deleting words Secretary General and inserting new paragraph after subsection 1, paragraph 3, 4, as for two regional administrative secretaries. This goes on, and the functions of that office being created, being defined. Amendment of Article 17. Article 17 of the Constitution is amended in subsection 2, paragraph 117, by inserting the words or sponsored candidates after the word member. And the same amendment for Article 17 is subsection 2, paragraph 118, by deleting the word constituency and replace it with the word word. The same amendment in subsection 17, in subsection 2, the same article in paragraph 118, 
by inserting the word sponsored candidates after the word councillor. The same amendment in subsection 4, paragraph 17 of article 17, by inserting the word sponsored candidate after the word member. Similar amendment in the same article in subsection 4, paragraph 18, by inserting the word sponsored candidate after the word councillor. Amendment of Article 24. This article is amended by inserting the new article as follows. The council may be amended upon the approval of two-thirds of the Central Committee. Appendix 2. United Democratic Party 2018 Congress Resolution as I read earlier on about 10 points resolutions were passed and I did read the, those resolutions. Now, that ends the report of the 2018 Congress, and I want once more to thank the Secretariat that ably did this work and make us to present this report. I will not say for the first time, but to have a more accurate report of this nature, once more, we need to commend the Secretariat that was responsible. I thank you for the job well done. And Congress delegates, I thank you all. Thank you very, very much, um, Honorable Alaji S. Dabo, Acting Senior Secretary, Administrative Secretary, um, for sharing the statement and outcomes of the 2018 Congress, and also summarizing the deliberations of the Congress. I think you have um, really done justice to sharing the overview of the report. Um, given, I don't know whether given the, the, the timing and given that uh, people have been eating and are tired, I don't know whether I should uh, request with your permission, um, Your Excellency, to have a very short interlude just to wake uh, people up for a few minutes before we start um, the next session on the finance. Um, can we now invite... Um, on the floor, the entertainer, who starts just uh, just one one um, one one track, so that we can uh, at least liven up the, the the hall before we get to the next sessions. Thank you. I come in banquet and want to meet you. Tomorrow, my honourable Alaji S. Dabo, I banquet okay. Bunda la mimbe dending tama nyandi nyala. Minu ketano mpatio yeminke no mkomanto. Ako kabiru wabota je woku mfata tumalamina. Janin kadungu fulanya ngo nyinkono. Alafita ka moku mandimi ya alonko. Ashina ka molu entertain jang. Kafenke mi ya alonko ase molu besa warendi. Mawo mfele mbota kontonga la. Tumando batu jame kuna nkolbe shino la. Janika shino ese kuke mi ya alonko ase molu besa warendi no. So yuko ibole kumandi la pura ena ayitulungo keno. I would like to call on the, is it the Casamas Boyo? Casamas Boyo, is he around? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ya 
I hear many people who can call me customers. I'm a Senegalian, okay? I'm not a Senegalese, I'm a Gambian like you guys. Okay? So, I'm going to tell you that I'm going to go to Senegal. I'm going to go to Senegal. Okay? Yeah. I'm going to go to Senegal. I'm going to go to Senegal. Okay? I'm going to go to Senegal. 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 Ani mulai dia langkau na will die ka will na ella ella so ambe mumet entulah ambe jela Lord may your banjul rohimalik lom be kontana Angul suku singa tembe kontana bak tembe terlam be jela Okay ane France chapter ngai tentu ngai jai because kuno ifane bulu fenyum madin na ngalong He Excellency witness le Okay ambe UK chapter angkul kontana bak ane Cas chapter Ol beba kata kene, beba usen kanun tewal lagi. Manjai biru ambal kontra ambal dan ambal jala lamin damfa Usman ngal kontra kita betul fono bar betung. Nsa dan tewal poje. Dige UK chapter la musico did not night. Okay, thank you very much. Eka manjine raya kata bake ila doku beteada. 
UK chapter at Rako Dina DJ. Okay. Abaraka, 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 Abaraka. Thank you very, very, very much, Abaraka. Thank you for charging the batteries and energy of everybody. I think we needed that after the food. So um, we're glad that um, he was able to do just that. Ah, uh, only the book can you eat and all the minto mobe minibesino le fele kuninta bao ninjulo min teta ten na pati nyaton koe where I can deal a comomo besino la bebe kunir in a silang a wato sita silang binabunda flan yamoto but yan name bita auto a be banker or killer minketa yang amame ala honorable alaji s dabwe min sata tamandirinal to minutambita Abina wale talaka adomandingo itandala puru molbe sa pahamno min alaji dabwe min fajan sainteng. Thank you very much. Um, we will now go back to business as usual. I um, have the honor to now invite the next speaker who will present the, the financial report. It gives me great pleasure to invite Honorable Amadou Sane, the National Treasurer of the United Democratic Party, to the podium. A round of applause for Honorable Amadou Sane. Honorable, you have the floor. Thank you. I command it okay, Honorable Amadou Sane, Walebina, Kaitandi, okay, Kabanke, okay, Kuala Minibedending, Nafulo Kenyala, Minda Pansita, Min Sotota, Tumo Minna, Tamandiro Liketa, Nin Sanji Fulo Min Tambita, Abina, Waleitandi Latin, I command it okay, Honorable Amadou Sane, Asina, I tandiro okay, Jama Molbela. Ladies and gentlemen, um, my apologies. I want us all to stand up and give a huge round of applause to His Excellency Husseinu A.N.M. Dabo, who is the President, the Secretary General and Party Leader and future President of the Republic of the Gambia, come 2021, to give the activity report. Your Excellency, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam Moderator. Thank you, Democracy, thank you. Democracy Allah Baraka. Huh? Thank you, Democracy, thank you. <coughs> Allah Baraka Baka Democracy. I think uh, Kasama's work was very ele electrifying. Uh, took us all of us from the deep slumber we might have been. So thank you. Democracy, Altanin Ken Ola de Kazmas Boyo Benke, Alto Ken Ola de. Anyway, Madam Moderator, I am tasked to present the activity report of the party from our last Congress to the date of convening of this current Congress. The activities undertaken by the United Democratic Party since December 2018 are many. And therefore, it is not possible to catalog all the events 
constituting the activities. We'll just have to be selective in our presentation. Because an activity undertaken by the party in Khartoum should also be reported on. But we cannot do that. So I'm being selective to highlight the key events that took place since December 2018. Was said that uh, in 2019, there were a series of activities. There was the Women's Wing National Congress, which was followed by a rally at the SSP. And this rally was attended by all members of the executive. It was also part of the activities of the party to be hosted by the people of Gunjur for the National Youth Congress, which was held in March 2019. And, uh, In March 2019, when precisely on the 15th of May 2019, when Honorable Amadusane, uh, the late Lamin Dambundeba, and myself were relieved of our cabinet positions that provided us a unique opportunity, an opportunity that we had always looked for, to concentrate on the party. As they uh, believe the one of who say, Pichabure Chachi Kejam, the fine now, then Funeka Lukone. So, in March, I was invited by the UDP Seattle chapter for a fundraiser. It was the best, it was the first and probably the best engagement because it set up the standard for other parties. As I was holding meetings with people in Seattle, the UDP was busy in Tujere with the Yellow Sisters. As I was holding meetings with people in the United States, the UDP was busy with people in Bunuakunda, in Brufut, and in Basse, and Soma. Result of my visit to the United States really led to the galvanization of our party support it led to the re-engineering of our party's efforts to assert itself as the dominant party. In fact, when I arrived at Banjul International Airport on my return from the United States, the event was one of its kind. It had never had happened in this country. Since then, the party has been holding rallies. We held the mega rally at Nyani Jadume Koto. We thought that the rally in Soma, we thought that the rally in Bundu and Brufut were rallies that could never be surpassed. But what took place in Nyani made us and everyone of Nyani extraction to be very, very proud. It was a morally of its kind. And the OYC, All Yundum constituency, also organized a rally in July of 2019. Bakao also did 
and their rallies are always preceded by the Barawulo march from Kajikale to Kajikalo to Mamakoto and around to the beach. In 2020, November to be precise, the 10th November, we left for Balibusal, Kenya, to hold a rally on the 1st of December. On the 1st of December. Again, that rally raised the bar from, from Jarume to a higher height. And uh, it was a rally that was accompanied by the laying of the foundation stone for the UDP Bureau in Jabakunda. On 22nd February, the Lord Mayor of Banjul hosted us, or hosted her party in uh, Banjul. And uh, that rally was one of its kind. Duty had held rally several days, several locations in Banjul, but the arrangements, the turnout on that occasion was one that we had never witnessed in the past, except the rally that we held at Vizaral Street in 1996 when we were launching the party. That was the only rally that is comparable to the Lord Mayor's rally. So we applaud the people of Banjul, as we have said, and your people for really hosting us well. The, the Brikama Market Kambian Kafo, in collaboration with Ibrahim Adiba, also organized a rally in honor of UDP in Brikama. And since then, the UDP was uh, gearing up to the old Badibu rally, which was supposed to have been held at the end of March. But unfortunately, the COVID-19 pandemic came on us, and as a result, we had to defer all political activities. And we continued postponing all political activities, even though some other people were busy on the political terrain, crisscrossing, and uh, positioning themselves. But we were true to ourselves and to our country, and we decided that we will lay off all activities. And uh, uh, but prior to that, let me say, I'm, I'm proud to announce that uh, our party embarked on some humanitarian visits when there was uh, flooding, massive flooding in Basse and in CRR, our party went to Basse and made a donation of $300,000 to the Basse community through the area council and the disaster management committee. We made similar donations of $300,000 to the Janjamri Area Council in order for that council to help assuage the negative impacts of the flooding. And we crossed over to Kuntawuru and donated $300,000 to the Kuntawuru Area Council in order to help the disaster victims in the Central River Region North. And on this, two, on all, on this occasion, I was accompanied by the Deputy Party Leader and the President of the Women's Wing. When there was disaster in Basse, when fire broke out in Basse, again, the party forgetting or putting aside politics, we went, decided to visit the area council chairman and the 
the, the governor as well as the disaster management committee, and we made a donation of four hundred thousand dollars to the to the Basse Area Council to supplement their efforts in rebuilding the Basse market. I'm happy to say that our contributions may not have been in millions, but what we contributed is doing well to bring up the market to its standard. I claim that my party has contributed towards the building or rebuilding of that, of that market, and no, other, no individual can claim that it is only their efforts. We did it when really the people needed it. And uh, we did it while it's not opposition. Probably we would have done it much earlier and better if we were in government. When there was disaster at Bak uh, Brikama, my party also uh, did not lag behind. We went Brikama, West Coast, Brikama in particular, I wouldn't say it's my backyard, but that is where the father of the party, Sane Kunda, that's where they are. When they are struck by any calamity, by extension, I am struck and UDP is struck by the same calamity. And we could not be left behind, so we also went to Brikama and made a cash donation of $400,000, which we are handed to the market committee. The COVID, which really, uh, which really halted our activities, has some devastating effect on the Gambian population. I established I mean, a COVID fund well, which we call the Buntung, non-apolitical, non-political, it's completely apolitical. But the, the bulk of the contribution came from members of the UDP, and I'm very thankful to them for their contribution. And this we did present, I mean, we did I mean, uh, distribute the uh, proceeds of the donation to the people of the Gambia. We embarked on a foundation lane of our bureaus. Pinala, well, Sal Kenya, as I said in, in, uh, in December, Sal Kenya, after the Sal Kenya rally, we did one in uh, Njabakunda, and this was followed by the one in Queen Allah. The United Democratic Party went out in numbers, as is usual, to respond to the call of their comrades, their compatriots in, the, in Kiang. The foundation lane of this uh, bureau was really one that was financed by the people of Queen Ella. I know as a fact that they embarked on fundraising activities in the Greater Banjul area to raise the funds to transport people there. In fact, the, all those people who went there private had hired their own vehicles to go and attend this occasion. I'm underscoring this. To highlight events that took place in Queen Allah after the foundation lane. That event was witnessed by people gathered from all over, as far as we're from Kantora to Carton, at the expense of the Gambian people. And 
Of course, even though that event that took place in, in Queen Ella, after, our, after ours, was funded by the Gambian people, it was really turned out into an activity by an organization that was seeking or is seeking to be voted into office. And that's the contrast. It is we who fund our activities, not get governments to fund our activities. The other grand ceremony that took place was in Sanyang on the 30th of October, 2020. Again, that was to lay the foundation stone for our Sanyam Bureau. That event, people were debating among themselves whether all these attendees are human beings. That was what people were saying. That shows that the UDP, when they are prepared to organize any event, they do it with perfection. They do it also with determination, with commitment, with sincerity, with honesty. They are not there. None of the people who attended that occasion were looking for a position for their brothers or trying to safeguard the positions of their sisters or wanting to be a safe home in Combo South. None of them. There's people who are not there, ordinary Gambians, for the sake of Gambia. A very important and unforgettable activity of the party was the welcome organized for me and uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Diba and uh, J. Paul when we returned from the Yakumba, when we returned from Europe. I you are people who have witnessed it, and I need not tell you, I need not give you any details of that. In fact, attempting to give any details of it would really be doing injustice, because maybe I just saw a minute aspect of that welcome. Others also saw minute aspects of it. Maybe we have to put all those together so that we can get the whole. But again, that was an event that I don't believe any party in this country can stage. And kudos to you, UDP, the organizing committee that really arranged this, uh, uh, this welcome. When thousands and thousands of people gathered at the Banjul International Airport to welcome us. Uh, it is opposite to mention that uh, in March of 20, March, April 20, 2020, or oh, before March 2020, but in 2019, the UDP took a decision that I don't think any party in this country had in the past taken. It was a decision to expel delinquent members of the party, National Assembly members who have turned disloyal to the UDP and uh, uh, been engaged in uh, delinquent and anti-UDP activities. As a party, that was unacceptable. As a party, we cannot condone that. We have to, the party decided that we have to operate the party on the footings of discipline. No person who is in discipline, no person who wants to conform with the, to the rules, no person who wants to be guided by the principle of the party can be retained in the party for the simple reason that such a person holds an elective office or whatever. We rather do away with delinquent members of our party rather than retain them and they become cancerous 
and increasingly becoming cancerous, so that by the end of the, by the time we are prepared to deal with them, they would have caused the vas I mean, I mean, serious damage to our, to, to, to our body. We cannot allow that. So we expel those eight members. And in like vein, we expelled the delinquent local government authority members, two councillors from West Coast, and the chairman of the and the chairman of the uh, of the Brigama Area Council. We had expected that elections would have been held by now, but our surprise, our surprise and disappointment. Simple English. The IEC chairman and his advisors are unable to comprehend when the language is quite clear that when a person ceases to be a member of the party on whose platform he contested election, he will cease to be a member of the council. There is nothing as clear as that. There is nothing as simple as that. Not even a grade 12, even a grade 6 student would understand that language. But. The IEC has chosen, the IEC has chosen to our disappointment to engage in food dragging and forcing us to go to court. It's a great disappointment. And if we people have to continue to have confidence in the IEC, the IEC must behave in ways and manners that will make people have confidence in them. This is our confidence in IEC simple language they could not understand. It was a ploy why they were dragging their feet to seek an amendment to the Local Government Act. But they thought that such an amendment would have saved the person whom they wanted to have retained in the office. But the amendment could not save him. But the unfortunate thing is that we have to go to court and that I believe is not doing well for the credibility of the IEC. The, there were various regional, regional uh, activities done, regional tours by the uh, National Organizing Committee as well as the National, as well as the national um, uh, Campaign Committee. Uh, the, the, the party uh, the, no, the party participated in the by-elections in the Jarga ward, and uh, we, we, lost the, we lost the elections, but the good thing about it is that we now know what to do in that, what to do in that constituency. We now know how to go about increasing our fortunes in that constituency. We wouldn't have known what our situation was there if we did not contest the elections that bid by elections. So we are happy that, uh, we, we, are happy that uh, we, uh, we contested the by elections. The youth wing, national youth wing also took, undertook various activities. Uh, there was a youth congress on Saturday, 2nd second, second March 2019, held at Gunjur, and as I already stated, that congress was followed by a youth rally. In March of 20, in March of 2020, the members of the youth wing, namely the Secretary General, Kemo Boja and female regional leader from the North Bank region, Michelle Mendy, left the, left the Gambia for China to attend the China Political University and participated in the Africa China Youth Political Party program. This afforded them some fruitful uh, experiences, and uh, since their return, Kemo Bojang has been trying to put into use uh, some of the things he learned at that, uh, he learned there. Uh, this was in uh, March 2019. And in April 2019, the youth wing organized the Vixens March Pass and also the Solo Sunday Memorial Lecture, which was held at the Mercy Hotel in Kololi, in collaboration with the Helal Group and the Solo Sandem Foundation. This day is celebrated annually on the 14th of April to commemorate the lives and sacrifices of members of the party and their contribution in the democratization process. Unfortunately, this year, 
because of the COVID-19, we could not hold the memorial lecture and we could not hold any activity to honor Solo Sandem. In the month of Ramadan, the youth wing, in collaboration with some of the constituencies, organized a daily iftar and also food items were distributed within the constituency to support the needy families. In July of this year, in July, in July of this year, the Secretary General of Duty in Kemo Bojang was selected for the prestigious Mandela Washington Fellowship, where he spent three months in the United States and uh, built working relationship with the youth wings of the Swapo Party in Namibia, APC in Nigeria, Pastor of Senegal, ANC of South Africa, and many others. In November, the youth wing participated in the draft, in the draft constitution consultation organized by the Westminster Foundation, where the youth wing submitted, recommended, submitted recommendations and positions on the draft, on the draft, on the draft constitution. In March, on account of the activities, the youth wing was able to influence 60 youths from the NPP to defect to the UDP, to in the North Bank. The, the youth wing was the first to roll out COVID response by supplying hand washing points around the country. The youth wing also shot videos and hired a sign language interpreter to help in sending a more inclusive message to all sections of society. The youth wing and its members and, and its member and members of the student union wing also took part in sensitization programs within KMC and West Coast region. This sensitization campaign was carried out to enlighten residents and non-residents on the dangers of coronavirus, its modes of transmission and prevention. As the overall food supply chain in the country, especially the penniless ones, was cheapening in exponentially at the peak of the pandemic, the students' wing of the youth wing deemed the fit also to chip in and contribute its quota into the food bank initiative that I had established. In October, the youth wing, in collaboration with the Campaign and Organizing Committee, held a three-day nationwide tour across the regional bureaus and also visiting of the youth farms across the country. In the North Bank, the youth coordinator and its youth cultivated the Findi farm in Badibu Gunjur and beans in Jabakunda, in which harvesting was successful. In Central River region, the youth of Upper Fuladu West also cultivated rice fields in the Bankunda and they had very good harvest. Program home, 11 bags. And similar farming was done in Nyamina Jare and Wuli in Upper River, on Wuli in Upper River, in Upper River region. The women wing, uh, as I had mentioned earlier, held their congresses in February 2019, and this was followed by a rally in Brikama by under the new executive. On the 30th of August 20, 2020, a delegation of 32 women from diverse settlements in Fonyi Kansala paid courtesy visit to the National Women's Executive Committee under the leadership of Jasukai Naka. The women of Kansala were honored to have been graced and celebrated by the party. They expressed their support to the party and promised to do their part in the promotion of the party towards national development. This occasion was graced by senior members of the party including myself, who had showed the heartfelt gratitude to, to the visitors. Due to the uh, COVID pandemic, the second leg of the tour intended by the women's wing uh, has to be postponed. And we hope very soon, we hope very soon that this tour will be, that the women's wing will embark on this tour. As I stated earlier, there have been various activities, but then these are the key events that uh, thought we should bring it to the attention of the, uh, of the Congress and hopefully uh, what has been done in 2018 to, 20, to 2020 uh, 
will certainly be doubled in 2020-2022 uh, tenure of the, of, of the new executive. I thank you for your attention. Another huge round of applause for His Excellency Lawyer Seuno Dabo. Thank you very, very much for highlighting uh, the key activities. As you mentioned, um, party leader, um, you, couldn't, you wouldn't have been able to do justice with all the activities that were done between 2018 to date. But you highlighted areas that included sensitization rallies, laying of foundations, humanitarian support work, um, international visits, particularly to our diaspora families, um, human resources and administrative work, um, the by-elections that were held, the activities of um, the youth wing, particularly the Solosanding um, Memorial Commemoration, as well as um, the youth's activities in response to COVID-19. Um, I want to take the opportunity now to invite Honorable to invite the, the National Treasurer, Honorable um, Amadou Sane, to give um, the financial report of the United Democratic Party. Akamim Banke Jan Wolem Nintiko, Party Leader Kabra Nata Jan Alabanke Kono, Aini Itandiko Kujamale Keta. Bari metembo minto niko ibe obe sa atala jang, memela janne. Bari mobe alon neko, UDP ala activity nyin sang tambilalu. Yeminke ninkomba afala jang tebola jambi. Bari wolkono ku kumaya ringolu. Minu kumaya teje awala banketeng. Mimbe dendi UDP la lo kangola. Tumo minna ye makwe rodi, ye de marol di, dulala dinkirala. Mi alonko abe nyato tale, eh, awe nyato tale sabmanang. Ye bankero fanadi, mimbe dendim fondin ke latana ni nanya la patio kono. Ye doko minke nyin santambila. Kabiru obota jenorong anata kumandiro ke, minketa UDP la, uh, ma, eh, kodo ma, minka kodo mutaka eh, nafulo mara, wala mnyinti honorable uh, Amadou Sane, uh, wala kumandipuru fanawe na bankero di. Party Leader, Secretary General, Deputy Party Leader and Secretary General, Acting President, um, President of the Female Wing, the Youth Wing, all executives, NAMs, delegates, distinguished invited guests, I want to say Assalamu Alaikum. Before I deliver figures, I just want to go back a bit and give you a little background um, that will make you appreciate the figures more. The Gambia we know today emerged from a very difficult economic situation. A political, political crisis created by a dictator who refused to leave the country, uh, country's governance. The economy was stalled with no program with the IMF that was a failed rainy season and a completely flopped tourist season. So over the period 2017 to 2019, when UDP was 
part of the coalition government. Your UDP party representatives served in various positions in this government. From Minister of Foreign Affairs, Lands and Regional Integration, Finance and Economic Affairs, the Vice Presidency, Agriculture, Trade, Industry, Employment, and Regional Integration. I think Gambians in general, not only UDP, will look back and have no regret in having UDP in government affairs, seeing the track record that they have displayed whilst in government. So just to remind you a few of the achievements of your UDP representatives in government, for the Gambia, that is our own homeland, let me list a few impactful developmental and transformative efforts whilst we served in the government. And I'm not a good uh, musician like uh, Kasa Masinko, but I would want you to join me in this. Who brought back Gambia from isolation into the community of nations, rejoining the Commonwealth, the ICC, and bringing back the IMF program after years of the disengagement. Who did this? The UDP representatives in government. So I want you to say it's the UDP uh, I'm not Casamasco, uh, but I want you to sing UDP in this. <laughs> then, who brought in the threshold program from the United States with their Millennium, Millennium Challenge Corporation to provide Gambia with over 30 million dollars in their threshold program? Who did this? UDP representatives. Uh -huh. Now your voices are coming up. <laughs> and then, who led the Gambia to prepare the National Development Plan that this coalition government has been singing everywhere and this current president is singing everywhere he goes in his campaign. Who led the preparation of this national development plan? The UDP. <laughs> then, who planned and assisted and took your president to Brussels to secure 1.7 billion dollars for the Gambia. Who did that for you? I think some were saying even the mines will have their share, the rats will also have their share, but we have not seen it. I have not got my share yet. I don't know whether you have got your share. <laughs> Now, when we started, the electricity was really serious, a serious problem, serious blackouts. Who laid the roadmap for the electricity modernization project? We secured funding for 50 megawatts of electricity with IDB promising to do 50% of that, and Badia and the Kuwaiti Fund were being negotiated, and they were willing to provide the balance. If you had 50, 50 megawatts of generation, new generation power, would you be in blackness? 
who stole the program, who we did the program, but who destroyed the program? <laughs> now, we negotiated that every school would have a solar power. Every clinic, health facility will also have solar power. This was part of our national development plan. Who negotiated for the Gambia for these things to come? We also helped in bringing power from Senegal to supply or some of their excess power. We purchased that, of course. And who also led the way for bringing a hydropower from the Kaleta Dam in Gini to improve the supply and the amount of power that we have to distribute to the population. Who did this? So I can go on and on and on. But the question I want to put at this stage is, if your representatives in a coalition government can move this country in such a short period that they have served, when you have a UDP government, what do you expect? A UDP government will take up all the developmental challenges that this country is facing. And it's only the UDP that has the capacity to transform this country from the bottom that we are in today to a higher height where you will all enjoy prosperity and not just for a few who are just, uh, how do you call it, self-aggrandizement, who are just feeling themselves. Some, they have big stromas, some have big cars, and so on. We are not that type. UDP is for the Gambia. I, I want you to repeat that. UDP for the Gambia. UDP for the Gambia. So, we and all Gambians are grateful for every Butut from the launching of the party to this day, and we look forward to the continued support to the party to sustain the party's goal of deepening and maintaining democracy, human rights, the rule of law in this country, and to also in a transformative economic development program, giving rise to prosperity for all the citizens. So, fellow members of the UDP, well-wishers, and all Gambians, you'll see that every single dollar given to the party means you are building the future for your country, the future of your children, and um, the prosperity that you deserve. And it's only the UDP in this country that can help you get that. So your money is well spent, and the party, I'm proud to say, 2019, we have produced our accounts, and it has been audited. So I hope other parties will emulate UDP. So we are taking the lead in this. In here, may I acknowledge the invaluable support and financial contribution of the diaspora to the UDP from inception to date. I personally can attest to this, having directly received funds from the diaspora for financing various party activities. As national treasurer, and on behalf of our UDP party leader, Secretary General and Secretary General, the national executive, 
and all members of the party, I want to thank the diaspora and pray that we continue to work together for the interests of our country and not for individual interests. I also want to acknowledge here every individual's contribution in cars or kind to the party, whether one butut or one million, your one butut contribution is worth more than a billion dollars of value today, having contributed to the freedom and the establishment of democracy in the Gambia. So, I think I can go now to figures. You know where the Buddhists and Bhutus are going. You know, when you send it to your party, you buy your membership cards, you give your donations or contributions or hire a vehicle. So the party is making sure that you get the best value for your Bhutus and Dallas. For the period January, 1st January 2019 to 31st December 2019, the party raised a total of five million two hundred and two thousand six hundred and twenty four dollars. This comprises of contributions of three million nine hundred and thirty nine dollars three hundred and eighty two dollars fundraising programs which raised five hundred and sixty three thousand seven hundred thirty six dollars and donations received of $698,506. Now the contribution figure of $3.9 million uh, comprises of contributions of National Assembly members amounting to $668,000. So clap for your National Assembly members. And then the diaspora, we received three million two hundred and sixty-six thousand eight hundred and eighty-two dollars as contribution. I think you need a bigger club than that. <laughs> um, the executive, well, I think the figure is so small, but we contribute too much. <laughs> Um, so far, we raised 4,500, but you can see that there are contributions in kind, in effort, in energy, and time, which uh, will amount to billions of dollars if you value it. But you can see that a lot of the, our executives also are unemployed. They are not earning salary. <laughs> so, so I think you should still give them a... Cl <laughs> A round of applause. <laughs> um, now, despite some people saying that they sponsored the 2016 presidential election and the diaspora did not contribute anything to it, as a witness working in the UDP National Treasury since 1996 to date, and I am so all those who worked with the Treasury or the executive know the tremendous contribution in campaign materials and in funds for the UDP to establish democracy, peace, progress, and justice in the Gambia that we can all smile at and we acknowledge the diaspora's contribution in this. And these efforts will not only lead to as we say, a smiling coast, but I think all Gambians will smile, even those in the agricultural fields around the country, in Banjul, KMC, Kombos, Fonyes, Badibus, Kiangs, Jaras, Saulums, Nyaminas, Fuladus, Jimaras, Tumanas, and Woolies will all smile for the Gambia. However, significantly absent from these income figures are the huge and invaluable support to the party in the hiring of vehicles, funding regional constituency and work programs, 
And these activities, if quantified, will amount to millions of dollars, which is an indication of the love of Gambians for their country and the ongoing task for democracy, rule of law, end to corruption, lack of transparency in public procurement of large government projects, abuse of office, discrimination in the civil service and state-owned enterprises, use of taxpayers' funds to finance unproven and which I think unfit personal political campaign officials in the false pretense that they are advisors to the Gambian presidency. For sectors, they have scarcely any semblance of knowledge to move this country forward. I think you are all witnesses to advisors dancing in political campaigns and so on, which really is an abuse of the civil service code, it's an abuse of the funds of this country. Why are we using taxpayers' funds to pay for advisors? UDP party members, well-wishers, and all fellow Gambians, let's support the party for the Gambians, and that is the UDP. Every Bhutut contributed to the party, every party membership card purchased, you should be rest assured that it is for the interest of the Gambia. And the UDP is the party for the development of the Gambia. And the UDP is the party for the establishment of true democracy, human rights and rule of law for the Gambia. I think the UDP will also ensure that the new revised constitution that reflects these values is passed through the National Assembly and Gambians will have the opportunity to vote on it as it is the charter that will govern their country. Now the other question I want to put is, who voted for the revised constitution in the National Assembly? I didn't hear that. UDP. Who sabotaged and aborted the efforts to give Gambians a better constitution that will provide the rights of all citizens, you know, get rid of the public order, give the rights of minorities, women, children, and youth. Who sabotaged that project? I think you should all know clearly that UDP is the party for the Gambia. It's the party for the progress of the Gambia. And then the UDP is the party for the effective and ded dedicated transformation of the socio-economic tragedies of the last regime and now continuing in the later part of this current borough regime since the arrival of a national, and is the NPP, I don't know even what that represents. But what I, what I will uh, say it represents is the national poverty program for the Gambia. And I will just briefly say why I say national poverty program. We all know that the donors have provided billions of dollars in COVID relief, in budget support and funds. But where are these funds? Have you seen any impactful development? Have you seen any progress or transformation in your hospitals? And somebody was telling me that Sedakunda Hospital lacks, um, is it a scanner? With billions of dollars, should you lack a scanner in the hospital? With billions of dollars, should you lack an ICU at the referral hospitals in Bansang, Farafenye, or Buyam?
I think, fellow members, there has been a lot of talk, but the reality is clear, even if you refuse to accept it, that the UDP is the best option that Gambians have to move this country forward. Now the UDP, your contributions will ensure, the UDP will ensure that we have a beneficial civil service sector reform that will manage and execute with effectiveness and efficiency the government's development agenda and not individual personal self-aggrandizement agendas. The UDP will also ensure that the security sector reforms are carried out in the interest of the Gambia as a nation. That will enable us to meet the security requirements of the country and ensure the total respect for the rule of law and, on, and the unshakable observance of the human rights of all citizens. Fellow delegates, let me go back to the figure. Um, the party spent four million five hundred and eleven thousand six hundred and thirty four dollars in operations and programs during the year twenty nineteen. The party's administrative costs for the year amounted to one million six hundred and eighty seven thousand one hundred and sixty three dollars. This includes the allowances given to bureau members, uh, administrative overheads, and rentals that we paying, amongst other expenses. The campaign and organizing costs also amounted to one million six hundred and fifty-nine thousand nine hundred and seventy-one dollars, and. Political rallies amounted to one million one hundred and sixty-four thousand five hundred dollars. Now, the campaign and organizing costs includes regional tours of three hundred and eighty-one thousand dollars, campaign materials of sixty-eight thousand dollars, victim support of one hundred and thirty-three thousand dollars, and also a support to student wings of forty thousand, and uh, welcoming expenditure for the party leader from the diaspora, about $642,000. The party also accumulated assets worth over $7 million, of which motor vehicles and motorcycles amount to $5,467,000. The party's furniture and equipment at the head office and the bureaus amount to $1,584,000. And we acknowledge the invaluable assistance of all well-wishers in sponsoring the party to achieve its goals for the Gambia. These party activities create awareness on the party's programs, our development agenda for the Gambia and not for party members or development agenda for our party leader only, Hussein Odabo. No, we are not like others. We want our agenda for the Gambia, just like we developed the National Development Plan for the Gambia, and not for individuals. <clears throat> so these activities also dispel important issues, some of which are false promises, misleading information, which are all aimed at political self-aggrandizement, which they disseminate to our beloved citizens. Fellow members, I would like to thank you all and assure you that the UDP stands for the Gambia, and together we'll march forward to victory in 2021 presidential elections.
And thank you all. Um, I just want to take this opportunity um, to translate a just summary in summary some of these issues in Fulad. Because I know we have uh, people from Fulad one. Um, unfortunately, some are saying uh, they couldn't hear last speakers in English and Manding, so I, I beg to um, just give a brief uh, summary. Because the UDP belongs to all, and I'll also take this opportunity to say, all those who point their fingers and accuse of uh, tribalism are just people dispelling false rumors and allegations and if today a government minister can stand and say only one tribe is being targeted in the immigration that is the fullest i want to ask you what is that person's tribe isn't he a fuller don't we have a fuller as Attorney General? Don't we have a fuller as uh, Chief Justice? Don't we have a fuller before as our Vice President in this country? So who is discriminating against the Fulanis? Not UDP. And for all ECOWAS citizens, the UDP will work within the ECOWAS framework to bring unity to the sub-region so that all this concept of a alliance cards and so on, that is so much of trouble for people all over the country from the sub-region will be a thing of the past. So please rest be assured, we are a party for all tribes all people and we are for the Gambia not for any individual tribe so let me summarize a better said said a full of Gambia men iwi e waftu me waftu waftu mo andi on metu no ekonomi on yanu no e tao men hebu Perfect skin. Skin care, Sasunere, Ninko de Ferek, Rolling Sohlatirek, Manam, when I am problem skin skin, Yen Hangan Fanla, Fing in the new. Um, a summer Haridik and the Jame, you have the task of playing son alone, Hanga don't hassle the lacquer home. In a Malinconak, why just in case, come Nico Gaida Here, Anka, just in case, Lord Hell, Hangan, Fing in the new, Fing in the new, Skin Care Plus, see Barrack Lenor, a Barrack. Funny lenyo dem chiru mi dileng indirect na products yuba. Do Paris, do Italy, do USA, ah? Do fun na kani sa? Bole ning chi Sweden. Fun na kani lenyo na ilile products. Buri tama na danga new reg new la ijama, ah? Natural beauty, that melanin dripping. We do have stuff for you as well. And when you skincare products like nyong chi chu bitamit, ah? Funny lenyo yar. In fact sa, 
Last commercial being the phone. Wow, you one of the new cover. Nine A grade, right now. Wow. We do have bundles as well. Hair. See you later, yodo. You know, kita fetal jigen rek. Literal jigen rek. Wow. What are the two kids amit? Book on that classic suitcase. You know, the new doctor I Samsonite. Been there in the any brown of suitcases though other than Samsonite. Come lima day wahrek. Bo ege airport. Dri Samsonite. Da fa amnu la hole. Wow. Ngen de la nak. Wow. Um, skin, si mom le nyugena hame nak skin care products, si mom le nyugena hame nyugena doctor mit bente temit si aydala, man wai man nak skin care moist my specialty. I'm gonna take in busa harka nam regle, lot of mujak. I mean, um, Patricia Reiner, Kiwi Eye the whole range, Lighten up Gold, um, Tomatine, I mean, the list can just go on and on and on and on. Lipo lo han regle ui taral jigin la, ki yu yu regle nyodok. Skin care plus nak. And we see Gambia, right? United States, Nungi Gambia fee. But pare, would they young anywhere in Europe? Mune laku mail. Within three days, right? Nyeti fun, right? Ngajot say do. And we see low, right? Then la consult to me. But I like I do. Then I get a free consultation. Pur wahla, right? Exactly linga hamne. Mo mingo aksa kanam. Then I get what I mean, right? I'm ning perfumes, you know, fragrances, men's shirts, um, accessories. We do do dresses as well. We do blouses. I mean, we do shoes. Name it, we do them. Skincare Plus 2020 is our year of perfection. Zero tasks. Who make any real me fit? Can what perfect tasks? Can what fit? I'm probably can I'm can what fit? I'm probably picture. Boka I mean, what fit? Can I like new law? The plus the fee. Stewart and Co. Solicitors, a legal excellence firm in London that can help you with all aspects of your legal work. If you are looking at immigrating to the United Kingdom, Stewart and Co. can help you to set up business, buy houses in the UK, and will deal with all your legal works from start to finish. For all your general immigration work, we can help you with that as well. If you apply for any form of visa, whether student visas, settlement visas, marriage visas, or a child wanting to come to the United Kingdom to settle with the family, we can help you to achieve your goals. Stewart and Co. Solicitors, a legal excellence firm specializing in conveyance, immigration, litigation, family law, personal injury, licensing, no win, no fee. Contact us today at www.sk-solicitors.com. No, I didn't buy any Welcome, welcome. Basically, lot of lala me along with school, man, that I can really relax. What a madam, yeah, what a madam, yeah, let him do some money. That's right. I a grand villa. That's fine. Yes, 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 no, 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 Na la bungul bebe senya ring adum na bungul bebe nyara ring coming ibe la fila ila suwe tara nyame until Grand Villa na kiliano la lafino wole mu kamo tin tel kam na ye sabati Grand Villa ye la kodo na fa kalamata. This is like a paradise. I know. Oh, no, no, no. I so much love this place. Yes, thank you, thank you. Trust me, I love this place. You come move somebody and you're watching one. Yeah. Yeah. I love this place. Okay. Yes, I love this place. <laughs> Ni left on a cool case of Sotola. Futama Olgin to Paradise Estate. By your commander, okay, seven five two seven two one eight. While a foot on the website auto, www.grandvillaguesthouse.com. Grand Villa Guest House.
Miss V Designer Outlet is the number one quality and affordable stop shop for all your needs. Get your evening dresses, suit and ties, office wears for both ladies and gentlemen, beach wears, sport wears, pure leather shoes for men, quality belts, bags, heels for all beautiful ladies, original perfumes, accessories and a lot more. Find us at Kololi New Road opposite Gaddafi Mosque at the Aqua Preacher Station or call us on 295-3411 or 764-2486. Miss B Designer Outlet. Shop right, look good.